In order to grow, cells need very specific environmental conditions – food, energy, proper temperature, and humidity. When growing cells in the lab, we have to create these conditions using culture media. Solid culture media is a mixture of agar and nutrients poured into petri dishes. In this exercise, we'll demonstrate the steps for preparing brain-heart infusion agar. Always check the lot number and expiration date. The right panel lists the composition of the media and the final pH. First, add 100 milliliters of deionized water to a graduated cylinder. Place a stir bar in a 250 milliliter flask. For the next step, we need an analytical balance. Place a weigh boat onto the balance pan. Press the tear key to zero out the weigh boat. Use a lab scoop to add 5.2 grams of brain heart infusion agar to the weigh boat. Now add the powder to the flask. Add about 75 milliliters of deionized water. Place the flask onto a stir plate. If you're using a combination hot plate and stir plate, be sure that the heat is turned off. After about two minutes, add the remaining 25 milliliters of water from the graduated cylinder. Stir the solution until all of the visible clumps have been broken down. Cover the flask with aluminum foil. We are using foil cupcake wrappers because they're the perfect size. Place a piece of autoclave tape over the foil and label it with the media name. Next, use the autoclave to sterilize the media. The heat from the autoclave will also help the agar to properly dissolve in the water. Power on the autoclave and make sure the drain valve is closed. Add deionized water to the level indicator line. Place the flask of culture media into the basket. Insert the basket, close the lid, and turn the handle to create an airtight seal. Use the control panel to set the mode to sterilize. The temperature to 121 degrees Celsius will run this cycle for 17 minutes. While it's running, enter the date and time and the operation details in the log and initial. Once the cycle ends and the pressure gauge reads zero PSI, use heat-resistant gloves to slowly open the lid and remove the sterilized flask. Back at the bench, place the flask onto the stir plate and stir the media very gently and allow it to cool to about 45 degrees Celsius. Pour the media into the Petri dishes. The amounts don't have to be exact, but be sure to cover the entire bottom surface, which is about 20 milliliters for standard size Petri dishes. Once the media has cooled, it will solidify and turn opaque. Here you can see the difference. The Petri dish on the left has set up properly. Turn the plates upside down to prevent moisture from condensing on the agar surface and store them in a plastic bag until you're ready to use them.